My name is Richard Rader. I'm, with the, I'm the Chief Technology Officer for the Cow Creek Tribe and we operate the Seven Feathers Casino and Resort down in Southern Oregon. So we were on Advantage 8.2. Many of the products that we had were end of life on the manufacturer side, so it really drove us to make the change, the technology change. And at the same time, we decided to refresh our entire infrastructure. Well, now there's a competitive need for us to go to a new product. IGT adopting to reporting services allows us the property to write any report we want to in the system using your methodologies, your security controls. Instead of having to pay IHG to develop a one-off report for us, we can do it ourselves in the reporting infrastructure using the exact same source data that your reports use. You know, we're a conservative property. We like new technology, but we don't jump in both feet on something untested or unknown. So we want to plan things out. We're very much about you know, understanding our risks, mitigating our risks, and moving forward with the right selections of products. So on the Advantage upgrade from 8.2 to 9.7, um, IGT sent a team out to our facility. They helped us configure a an operating lab, a remote lab, from our offices in um, Canyonville, Oregon, to Reno, Nevada, on the 9.7 platform. And then we brought every employee who was going to be working the gaming system through a training exercise in that lab over about three weeks. So our cage got to see it, our players club got to see it, our hosts got to see it, hotel got to see it, operators got to see it, marketing got to see it. We even had the state police come to view it. So we had quite a few hands-on eyes on our system to verify that, oh yeah, this looks great. So on Go Live, it's not a big hurdle of a new feature or a new function or something we've never seen before. We really did work like a team. So it wasn't us and them, it wasn't them installing the system that's taking it over the day left. It wasn't an IAGT team or a Seven Feathers team, it was the upgrade team. And it was Seven Feathers team members, IAGT team members. The IAGT product project manager and I became best friends in that upgrade week. And again, no one believed this was gonna happen. We had scheduled for 30 minutes of downtime. I knew we could do it faster than 30, but I wanted to do it at 30 minutes. So the general manager, our marketing director, all bet me steak dinners on the timing. So I'm sitting down on the gaming floor with our assistant general manager, it really was, you know, nine, nine and a half minutes, something like that was the actual timing. Game four came up. One by one, they started coming back up. We had less than 10 minutes downtime where there was no ticketing on the system. I also got free steak dinners out of, the, out of this situation. Probably the biggest benefit is performance. The performance in the code base of 9.7 meets and beats all the metrics we had for the 8.2 products. So on rebuilding the indexes and infrastructure upgrades, infrastructure components, 9.7 is by far uh, much better. Some of the product issues we had with 8.2 have all been resolved in 9.7. So we would easily and gladly upgrade again with the same upgrade team that we had for our, our 9.7 upgrades. I would recommend that everyone should go to the, at least the 9.7 code base. There's lots of features and benefits to being on the current versions. Plus some of the new features you may not use today, but you want to use. So you get yourself prepared. You get all the labs, all the systems upgraded, all the processes upgraded. Now we can add those new exciting features in 9.7. I would say our Advantage upgrades are 100 on a scale of 1 to 10.